In this video, I'm going to cover what to do if your LG TV says the Wi-Fi is turned off. So this is usually where you're using the Wi-Fi on your TV and it suddenly drops and then you go into the settings and it says that the Wi-Fi is turned off and you can't see any lists of networks. Or if you've tried switching your Wi-Fi on from the settings, but you're still not seeing any networks and the menu is telling you that the Wi-Fi is turned off even though you know that it isn't. So there's quite a few possible fixes for this. It's usually just some kind of software bug um, and it can be caused by a number of different issues. So we're going to go through the most common ones and hopefully get it fixed for you. If your LG TV is around five years old or so, there seems to be a pretty common bug where they keep dropping the Wi-Fi connection and uh, just changing your TV's location seems to work as a partial reset, which then stops the Wi-Fi um, turning on and off on its own. So to change the location, press settings on your remote, then go to all settings, then general and location, and then click on the LG services country option and change it from set automatically, which is what it's most likely to be on, to a specific country that's different from its current setting. So if you're in the US, just choose Canada. Um, and then your TV will ask you to confirm your choice and then it will restart and then go back to the same location menu and change your location back to the country you are in. So don't choose set automatically this time, just choose your specific country and your TV will then restart and if you then go into network settings and refresh your Wi-Fi connections, hopefully your Wi-Fi network should pop up. If the Wi-Fi is still saying that it's turned off, then try a, a soft reset of your TV. So this is a pretty basic thing, which you might have already tried, but um, it can be helpful just to do it four or five times because often it can um, fix software issues like this. So to soft reset or power cycle your, your TV, switch it off and unplug it and then hold down the physical power button on the TV for at least 15 seconds then wait for a further 30 minutes and plug your TV back in and try switching it on. You can try this three or four times um, and you can increase the time you wait and this can often help to fix software issues because it gives time for the power to drain from the capacitors of the TV and uh, so anything stored in the flash memory of your TV gets uh, deleted. If this doesn't help, then try turning off the quick start feature, which is present on, on some uh, recent LG TVs. So if your TV's got it, then press settings on your remote and go to all settings, general, quick start, and then switch it off and uh, restart your TV. If your TV is still saying that the Wi-Fi is turned off, then it's probably a good idea at this point to have a look at the Wi-Fi hardware module within your TV. So every LG Smart TV has got a, a, an individual Wi-Fi module somewhere within the case and they'll be connected to your TV's main board um, just by a ribbon cable and the cable can either come loose um, or the, the signal in the cable can be impeded by being twisted or caught around other components. So it's a good idea just to check that that Wi-Fi module is still properly connected to your main board. Um, if you see that there's damage on the, on the Wi-Fi module, maybe there's a, a, a burnt component or something, they're very cheap and easy to replace. So they've just got one little plug. Uh, you can buy a new one off eBay and um, just pop it in. So to have a look at this, you first of all need to make sure that you've drained all power from your TV. So you don't want to get a shock from any of the capacitors. So um, as with uh, power cycling, it, unplug your TV, hold down the power button, then wait for a further 30 minutes just to make sure there's no power left in your TV. You can then unscrew the, um, the back panel, uh, take it apart, and you'll see uh, in most LG TVs, you'll see three boards like in the picture. So um, a main board, a power board and a T-con in the middle. Uh, there should also be a Wi-Fi board which will be connected to the main board some, somewhere. Um, it would be pretty small. 
So uh, just have a look at the uh, the cable connecting it, see if there's any potential damage on the cable, uh, and just try disconnecting the Wi-Fi module um, and then cleaning the, the socket where the cable goes in and um, reconnect it. If your TV keeps dropping the Wi-Fi signal, then just make sure that your router is switched on and working properly and that there's no interference um, or blocking of the Wi-Fi signal. So check that other devices are able to connect to the internet through your router without dropping. You can also check the, uh, the DHCP and DNS settings on your TV. Make sure they are set to automatic. So these settings are in uh, net network and then Wi-Fi connection and advanced settings. If you've recently got a new router and you're having uh, problems keeping your TV connected to it, then it's possible that it's to do with the uh, frequency of the Wi-Fi signal. So particularly older uh, LG TVs will be using a 2.4 gigahertz signal. So just log in to your router um, using your phone or a laptop and, um, and just see which um, which signal your TV is connecting to, and you can then try changing the Wi-Fi modes or the bandwidths for each of the signals to, to see if it will help your TV connect better and stop dropping the connection in future. If you can't get a Wi-Fi connection at all, um, and your TV is still saying that the Wi-Fi is turned off, then it could be that there's a software issue uh, that can be fixed by updating it. So the only way to update will be to connect your TV to your router using an Ethernet cable. You could just do it temporarily uh, and then go into software update and update the software. And then hopefully when you remove the Ethernet cable, the Wi-Fi will be able to connect. And if you're still having connection issues, then the final step is just to try factory resetting your TV which you can find in all settings, general, uh, system, and then reset to initial settings. The, the default pin should be one, two, three, four. If you've tried all of this and you can't get your Wi-Fi to turn on on your TV, and you've tried factory resetting, and you've tried updating the firmware of your TV, and you're sure that the, the Wi-Fi module itself is fully connected, and that there's no breaks or damage to the cables connecting it, then the most likely option is a failure of the Wi-Fi module itself. So you could go onto eBay and just buy um, a replacement, which is usually pretty cheap. It is possible that it's still a software issue um, that just isn't resolvable. Uh, this does happen particularly with old LG TVs. So if you do want to go down the route of replacing the Wi-Fi module, I wouldn't spend too much money on it. Um, but they're usually pretty cheap if you have a look on eBay for, for old parts of TVs. You can also see some tips in more detail on the linked article below.